A quarter century ago, a young Jimmy Tactor left his family and homeland of Sweden, bound for America and its endless opportunities, determined to make a life in racing. When I was 17 years old, uh, I was very curious to go over here and work a year, so my father got me a job for uh, Continental Stable. I thought, you know, uh, when I was young, that, uh, you know, that, yeah, I think I'm going to do well here. I, you know, I saw a lot of opportunities. Jimmy returned to the States in 1982, this time for good, and with his wife Christine and year-old baby daughter Nancy. As the family grew, so did the accomplishments. Perhaps his finest season was 1997, when Hamiltonian winner Malabar Man also won the Breeders' Crown and was named Horse of the Year. The stable now numbers 50. Tactors bond with each horse, his secret to success. I think I can communicate, you know, it's like, I listen to them, you know, I, and, and uh, you know, it's, you got to be able to communicate with the, the oh, yeah. horse Anna. in uh, their, their language. Yeah. I see when the horse is supposed to do yeah. things and back off or be aggressive on them. And, you know, you got to be able to communicate with them too, you know. And uh, I think that's uh, something you're born with. Today, Jimmy trains two horses in the Hamiltonian, Malabar Millennium, a son of Malabar Man, and Bebop, the horse tactor has also opted to drive. Bebop is a horse with a lot of ability. I mean, he's... Uh, he, himself is the biggest enemy. I mean, ability-wise, I think maybe he's, maybe could even be the best in the field. He's got a lot of speed and uh, a little nervous and, uh, you know, he's, as soon as he, you know, he get into the race, he's fine. I mean, he, he, during the race, he's really actually quite nice horse to drive. You know, I, I'm very excited about him and uh, he got so much speed that he actually could, uh, you know, with a little luck and a good race and things like that, that I don't have to use him too hard, he could win this race. His horses have already won enough to build a new home and farm, Millennium Farm, which covers more than 100 acres and includes accents of Americana, a tribute to Tactor's adopted country and his dream come true. I've been very fortunate to have a lot of luck. I've been able to, you know, uh, race and train a lot of good horses and, uh, and uh, you know, been able to own my farm and build it up. And, you know, it's always been my dream. I have really nothing to complain of.